So what you see behind us is the corner station of LIGO. This is where the laser originates and at the very corner it hits a beam splitter where half of the light is split. So it goes down one arm. One of, that one of the arms is what you can see going off to the right. And then the other arm is coming directly towards us and going beneath our feet. We call these the X and the Y arm after Cartesian coordinates. This is the X arm and that is the Y arm over here. The light bounces back and forth inside of our arms. It then comes back inside of our corner station. It recombines at the beam splitter. And depending on if our arms have changed length relative to each other, we get different kinds of interference. And so we measure the amount of light that comes out of our detector and that gives us a direct measure of how the length of our arms have changed compared to one another. And if they have con changed compared to one another, it could be because of a gravitational wave passing by. We're also extremely sensitive to even the smallest vibrations from our environment. We're continuously measuring a small change in the length of our arms, which means that our, our data is our observations that we collect are noisy and we have to spend a, a lot of effort in order to develop data analysis methods that can extract real gravitational waves out of the noisy data that we collect.